Okay, here we are in post-trib moment number two, and this one really doesn't prove much of anything, but I'm just going to play a little bit here and just kind of get a good laugh. First, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. Now, what's interesting is that all the modern Bible versions, they all change and corrupt this passage, because this is such a powerful passage that just destroys the pre-tribulation rapture. Because what do those who believe in the pre-tribulation rapture say? They say, oh, Jesus Christ can come back at any moment. He might come back tonight. He might come before the end of this service. Well, this passage completely destroys that and exposes it as a deception. <laughs> uh -huh. Watch the first video. I already exposed this lying little false prophet right here. Uh, he's already been debunked on this. And then he goes on to read a new version, which, you know, <clears throat> of course, perverts the passage. I, you know... I don't disagree that the new versions are corrupt and satanic. I wouldn't disagree with that. So, again, he's just trying to, you know, prove a point that he can't prove. Second Thessalonians chapter 2 proves a pre-tribulation rapture. He can't deal with it.